What's up, everyone? Welcome back to another uh, Bitcoin mining with solar update. Today, talking about this sense. I've mentioned a couple times. Um, it's just a little device that sits in your panel. I'll show it to you in a second, orange. And it helps you just know how much power every single device, every down to the appliance uh, uses in your house and the light switches, everything. So it just uh, helps you dial in exactly what power you're using and where it's going. And the reason for this combining with the Bitcoin is I think this is the first time I've had solar. So it's the first time I've been a power producer myself personally. So like I'm learning all the ins and outs of like how much like money you make when you overproduce, you know, there's like a cost to the amount of power you use in your house and you're like benefiting from that. But then when you are an energy producer, there's now like suddenly there's like a market rate for the energy that you produce sending it back. But currently that rate is super manipulated and so combining being a power producer with knowing that you can send any surplus you create to bitcoin mining instead is just uh everything that's flowing through my brain right now so again sense this device like you can see on the back understand what understand what your home appliances lights and devices have to say see what's up know what's on and so it just gets you the data of how much power your home uses and like what you use so that you know exactly what your surplus is and then i'll show you what the uh, bitcoin miners inside all right so see this is what my bitcoin mine looks like i just have three ant miner s9s and these are like the lowest most accessible um bitcoin like asic that there is and so bitcoin mining you can't do with a uh, gpus or like standard computers anymore you have to have asics which are built solely for mining bitcoin and these are an older generation so they have bigger fancier ones that cost a lot of money but these are just the most like standard easy to find ones that are um, a little bit older generation and again because my whole goal right now is to use the sense to know exactly how much power my home uses and then just use the surplus to the bitcoin network so that i'm uh right at zero with my uh utility company so yeah here so ant miner s9 runs off of just standard standard outlet that's what's great about it and we'll give you a little noise test right now too it'll ramp up just a little bit and there's a little bit of variability but you can see yeah just standard garage style shelf super simple Now I'll go back to the panel, and today we're installing the uh, solar um, tracker of the Sense. All right, so goal for today is, yeah, just to get the solar clamps on. So I already had Sense at my other house, so I knew how to set up. Um, there's a bunch of good videos already on how to install Sense for the first time. Today, we're just clamping these onto where the solar comes into the main panel, and then hooking it up to the Sense. Check this out, this must be new. I've never had these ones before, but pulling this, So the clamps have like a lock on them now. That's a good, good improvement from the Sense team. What I'm doing now is I'm uh, just, before I button up the panel, I'm gonna make sure that the solar is feeding into the app first. And you can see that what I gotta do now is I gotta run the, um, run the solar setup on the app so that uh, the sensors just know what's coming in on the solar and then so it's reading what's happening in the house correctly And then we'll do more videos on this But this is kind of what it looks like where it um, figures out just appliance by appliance how much you're using So I'm gonna run the uh, solar setup and then we'll see where we're at Is done in the app and now you can see solar coming in and then house uh, using the power and this is I haven't had the sense turned on very long, so it doesn't, uh, it gets better and better over time and it'll find the devices and it'll find uh, how much power your house is using. But again, goal of combining all the knowledge of sense with Bitcoin mining is that like the dashboard from Sunrun doesn't give me up to the minute information of how much power I'm bringing in. And then the dashboard from SoCal Edison 
uh, doesn't show me how much power I'm using per minute and it doesn't show it down to the appliance. So what Sense does is it gives you a better dashboard to see your power production and your power usage so that you can know exactly how much surplus you have uh, in order to be used for whatever you want. And in this case, it's Bitcoin mining. I'm gonna document this part real fast too for all the Sense users out there. So I've seen repeated videos just like where to put your uh, antenna is kind of a hard part. And so right now you can see I'm dealing with a um, outdoor panel into the stucco. And so there's no way to do the knockout and have it just feed out. So what I'm thinking is I'm just gonna do my best to like do a carve out right here in the metal and then have the uh, antenna sticking out from the outside so I can still uh, lock the panel up. So we'll see how that goes. Tougher than it needed to be with the tools that I had, but here we go. So it slides all the way in and then panel can fully close now. So that's it. Thanks for watching.